Leo, how's it going? I'm Sephra Jerome, and I am here to give you your astrological forecast for the month of February 2019. Yes, here we are in the future for those that are over 40. We've made it. We made it to the future. And <laughs> Where the future is now. So Leo, um, you're, you're, you'll definitely be expecting things to happen on Valentine's Day. You're just one of those people that people love to love. You'll probably be flooded with presents. And if you're not, uh, you'll be looking around for some. But guess what, Leo? You have to give as well. So don't forget to shower your loved one with some presents or uh, cards, flowers, candies, uh, stuffed toys, books, records. Records? Oh my goodness, do they make such things anymore? Oh, actually they do. They've made a comeback. Um, gifts of any kind. And you know, some people uh, are just fine with a small little trinket, a little necklace or ring or something. And other people want like the 48 bright red roses. So at any rate, Leo, uh, spoil your loved one with what you can afford. And hopefully they'll spoil you back. And if you're trying to get someone's attention well we know this is the month to get it uh, but don't don't be stalkery and creepy either but certainly uh, um, enjoy helping other people and then so also what's ha on tap this month for you Leo is a new job opportunity uh, there may be a new job opportunity a career change um, financial opportunity depending on what you do right if you're a freelancer you may find a nice paying project coming your way to add on to all the other things you do if you've been looking for work this might be your lucky month for getting that job you've been looking for and uh you know, if you're trying to quit a job, um, you may find things lining up nicely for you. But don't forget, it's uh, uh, the economy's a, a weird thing right now. So if you do have a job you hate, just hang on, hang tight, because something good's coming. But you have to also apply for jobs before you can get new ones, right? So they just don't. For most of us, they don't just land in the lap. But if they're going to land in someone's lap, it will definitely happen to a Leo. Because <laughs> Leo are charming and charismatic, and you do have the ability to charm people into perhaps giving you things that you maybe don't deserve <laughs> like a job opportunity that other people have applied for but you have the knack for being in the right place at the right time plus with your charisma and your charm you you will just take that job away from someone else and you'll enjoy it and it'll be well paying so yeah so anyways it looks like a great month and when the full moon rolls around later in the month uh, just make sure that you're you're take a good look at your life you know we got to do our introspections every month or so it's kind of like a filter change or an oil check <laughs> you know where you just uh, see what you're doing and if what you're doing is what you should be doing and if uh, there's any bad habits you need to get rid of like maybe you drink too much or smoke too much dope or maybe you're smoking cigarettes or maybe you got a little chubby over these uh, here here in Toronto um, we've been having minus 25 weather for a couple of weeks so we're all gaining a lot of weight here uh, in the cold areas and then of course in places like Australia it's been insanely hot like the pits of hell opened up over there and uh, so everyone's too hot to move around to get stuff done so you know, if you're living in extreme temperatures, it's easy to pile on the pounds because you don't want to leave the house. <laughs> so take, take a good look at your habits and your lifestyle choices. And uh, this is an excellent month for working through all that stuff while we hurdle our way towards spring. Okay, so bye, Leo. Have a great month.